how come your English is so good? Do you get that question? Yeah, yeah a lot. Yeah, and what do you tell them? Well, I used to go to vacation here every summer. Every summer, yeah. Exactly. My job is to go to their school and to put, give them back that value that they have, that they bury. Because there is, a, there is an identity crisis that happens. Okay, and sometimes I find myself in those shoes where, you know, people ask me where you're from, I give them the responsibility to continue to pass on that amazing rich culture that they have. I am a museum educator for the Haitian Heritage Museum. We are all different people. We may share the same cultures, we may share similarities, but we have in ourselves our own different experiences in our lives. And poetry is one of the ways that we can use to express ourselves. Responsible for the perception of me, all natural from the roots, with strong intelligence and deeply rooted, unwavering from the approaching storms, and that's who I am. Whoa! I do know about the history, so the geography, the culture, like everything, and I do feel the responsibility to pass it on. And I think it's really interesting that you, as an outsider, you know, it's it's the right way to do it, as in the anthropological aspect of it. You have to be an outsider to talk about what's going on inside the culture. The pearl of the Antilles. That's my feeling. It's like it's a pearl. It's a jewel. It's just a beautiful island. It's a hidden jewel. If you if you don't know that a jewel is there, you won't find it. So I think once you experience it once for yourself, it just kind of illuminates your life. And